ISF Single Bond Validity Period Welcome to our video on extending or renewing your ISF single bond. In this video, we'll discuss what an ISF single bond is, why you might need to extend or renew it, and how to do so. We'll also provide some tips on getting the best possible rate. What is an ISF single bond? An ISF single bond is a type of bond issued by the International Swaps and Derivatives Association (ISDA). It's a fixed-rate bond with a maturity of one year. ISF single bonds are typically used to hedge against interest rate risk. Why might you need to extend or renew your ISF single bond? There are a few reasons why you might need to extend or renew your ISF single bond. Your original maturity date is approaching. If your original maturity date is approaching, you may need to extend or renew your bond so that you don't have to go through the hassle of issuing a new bond. The interest rate on your bond has changed. If the interest rate on your bond has changed, you may want to extend or renew your bond so that you can lock in a lower interest rate. You need to raise additional capital. If you need to raise additional capital, you may be able to do so by extending or renewing your ISF single bond. How to extend or renew your ISF single bond? To extend or renew your ISF single bond, you'll need to contact your bond issuer. The issuer will typically provide you with a form to complete and submit. You'll need to provide the following information. The original maturity date of your bond. The new maturity date of your bond. The interest rate on your bond. The issuer will then review your request and let you know if it can be approved. If your request is approved, the issuer will issue a new bond with the extended or renewed maturity date. Tips for getting the best possible rate. When you're extending or renewing your ISF single bond, there are a few things you can do to get the best possible rate. Shop around for different issuers. Different issuers offer different interest rates on their ISF single bonds. By shopping around, you can find an issuer that offers you the best possible rate. Be prepared to negotiate. The issuer may not be willing to give you the best possible rate on your bond. If this is the case, be prepared to negotiate. Consider extending your bond for a longer period of time. The longer you extend your bond, the lower the interest rate you're likely to receive. However, you need to weigh the benefits of a lower interest rate against the cost of extending your bond for a longer period of time. Extending or renewing your ISF single bond can be a good way to hedge against interest rate risk, raise additional capital, or simply avoid the hassle of issuing a new bond. By following the tips in this video, you can get the best possible rate on your extended or renewed bond. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below.